This all started with a simple breast augmentation, right? Yeah. I decided to treat myself to breast for my birthday. This was actually last summer. Okay. The very next day, the left breast was swollen up twice the size of the right breast, and the nipple was turning purple. Okay. Hematoma. Hematoma. So I went back to her, and she said, why don't you come back Friday? I've got, I've got surgery all day, but if you get to the hospital early enough, I'll take a look to see what's going on. That's a surgical emergency that is now pressing on the underside of your nipple, cutting off the blood supply and potentially the surrounding breast tissue. There are a few absolutes in medicine and surgery, and one of the most significant is that when you get a collection of blood in a pocket in the body, you go right to the operating room and you remove it. And the nipple was turning darker this whole time. The nipple was black at this point and crusting over. And the incisions themselves are bursting open at this okay. point and oozing and bleeding. And she looked and she said, that's gonna absorb itself, you're gonna be fine. I knew it was infected. I could smell the infection and I just trusted her. So I go to see my family doctor and the second I took my shirt off, she, she was, freaked she out. She freaked. Of course she did. You have MRSA. Oh God. Oh God, you have MRSA. You, you didn't go to a surgeon, you went to an assassin. If the MRSA became that severe that it eats through the muscles and then the tissue overlying the rib cage, it could have got down to the heart. Obviously, that would not have been good. We did the surgery. I had them remove both of the implants. They cut off most of my breast. I was sewn up vertically. Right. I had nothing left. You basically had a mastectomy, not to a cancer, but due to a cancerous doctor. Yeah. 